So last video was cut off short because uh, my dog was going apeshit crazy because my nephew was outside and she wanted to go outside with him, so I went ahead and let her out. They were both pretty intense. Okay, now what is going on here? Who's, whose room is this? Oh shit, Sam. I guess he did make it to be an army man. Wait a minute. Was that Calvin? I the same picture they had in the Sam room. Sam spent his life shooting photos, but Mom said he got nervous being in front of the camera. I guess we're all afraid of something. Wow, he had a lot of medals. He had a purple heart. Look around the room before we go do his stuff. Rocking a little taxidermy there. Okay. Hmm. Alright, let's go check his uh, story and find out what's going on. Never forget this weekend. Yes, sir. These memories are going to last a lifetime. Mm -hmm. Am I going to have to shoot anything? It's a hunting trip, Don. Perfect. It's going to rain the whole weekend, isn't it? Please just take the damn picture. Hey, language. <laughs> Never forget this weekend, Dad. That's the spirit. Odin Finch National Park. Okay, got it. I'm gonna take some pictures, okay? Just be careful. The camera's older than you are. Okay, so we need to focus in on some places here. Let's try that place. You're right, Dad. It's starting to clear up. Still well, shit. Shit, fuck, I'm terrible at pictures. Where are we going there? What are we looking for? Is that what I'm supposed to be looking at? The thing right there? I'm just wasting your film, old man. Oh, that's what I'm looking for. Aww. I was taking a picture of the damn island. Okay, there's nothing else there. Try to take pictures of those damn birds. I keep taking pictures of birds, I don't know what else I'm supposed to be taking pictures of. Um, take a picture of that. I feel like I am playing that Saw game though because I swapped out my lighter for the camera and I just kept taking pictures. What is going on here? Definitely should not have drunk all that coffee. Oh, there we go. Hold still while I take a picture of you. I definitely won't be moving. Are you done? Hey! <laughs> That's a keeper. Okay. Nothing quite like being outside. I'm just saying, I'm not always going to be here, Don. You'll need to remember this stuff. 
if you want to survive. I'll be fine, Dad. You know who else thought he was going to be fine? Some guy who died. Don, I'm being serious. I know, Dad. You're always serious. Doesn't being out here make you want to chill out? Well, to tell you the truth, I haven't been out here in 20 years. I'm trying to get a close shot of that, whatever the hell that is. Last time I was with my Don, don't you think you could find something more interesting to photograph? Your grandpa Sven taught us how to fish. How to build a fire. We found an old logging trail. With deer everywhere. All right, if well, I can remember where that trail was, we'd spot a buck for you in no time. Probably right there. Give me a minute to check the map. I keep looking at that, but... Um... There we go. Got him. Before you take the shot, let me get a picture of him. The circles us for Scott's here. Where am I supposed to take this picture? I'm confused. <laughs> You gotta look all over the day. Oh, oh, oh ha. I just breathe. Turn off. Let me get behind you. <laughs> I'm looking everywhere but where I need to be. Don, you don't have to do anything. But if you want to survive, you need to be strong. Great shot, Don. Damn! <laughs> I'm proud of you, Don. Uh. Remember that, okay? She don't want to do it, though. Sorry, Don. Just got to reset the timer. Totally normal, Don. Just focus on the camera. Try not to think about Dad! Oh. Of all these stories, that's the one I wish most that my mom had told me. Well, now we're crawling through insulation over here. Duct work. I don't know, many, uh, <clears throat> when I was a kid, I used to, I used to uh, go with my grandfather to go work on stuff, and we always did like random jobs. That? My mom and Amy um, got really close. They'd both lost a lot. And, uh, so yeah, there was, uh, some duct work. I don't know how many times I've had to crawl in random spaces. Finch control. There we go. Oh, now we're talking about Gregory here. Oh, he's a baby. <sighs> oh, here we go.
Dear Kay, do you remember the way Gregory used to laugh when he thought he was alone? Like something funny was happening, but only he could see it. I think he saw things the rest of us don't. Okay, what are, we, what are we doing here? We gotta constantly, there you go. Okay, we can actually make this thing jump. Hold on, sweetie. Oh, don't tell me he does in the bathtub. Sam, I told you I don't want to talk right now. Probably need to. I wonder what he saw. What his world was like. Okay, there we go. We got another one, and there we go. Maybe, <clears throat> man, I fucking hate this because of, because of thing. He saw. Sure made him happy. I'm hoping the water doesn't kick on and he. I was right on top of it. Ah! Okay, so I need to jump on the whale's head. Where the yo oh god? Come here. Come here, bastard. It's coming so close to getting get there. There we go. I'm trying to get to the, the stopper. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I know this is going to end well. Wait, what? Oh, shit. sucks. Look at him. He's all happy and everything. 
What do we got I can't here? Imagine my mom ever writing poetry and yet. A poem for Gus, who always said the wedding was a bad idea. Our father never hit us kids, at least not very hard, before the day my brother said with teenage disregard that he'd be dead before he'd see a wedding in our yard. Okay, we got this. this okay. We're flying a cut. What are we supposed to be doing now? Okay, we, we, take, we take out the words, okay. My father made him come, of course, but Gus stood far apart, just flew his kite and bottled up the storm inside his heart. There's the totem pole. I tried to talk him out of it, but though he'd never met her, we don't need a stepmom or the words that I I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Oh, here's something right here on the totem pole. When the time for photos came, Dad ordered him to come, come here. here. But Gus declined, and as a sign, held up his middle finger. <laughs> That's one way to do it. The wind picked up, and panicked geese appeared and quickly went. But all the humans did that day was go inside the tent. Supposed to do something with that. Go inside the tent, okay. Well, let me go inside the tent. I'm trying to fuck around with the tent. But it, but it, it declines, it refuses. Oh, here we go. Rain came down in buckets then, but no one seemed afraid that nature might destroy the tent our dad had crudely made. It's like rolling Katamari almost. <laughs> but not exactly. The thunder sounded much too close and full of angry power. But all my father said to this was, make the music louder. truly say I thought about you on that day. Out there on the beach alone. Just you, the wind, the sea, and foam. But I didn't. Until we found you. She never talked about him, but Mom told me once if I was a boy, they were going to name me Gus. Gus. So that was the uh, mohawked boy from Sam's room in the hunting picture. What we got here? It says race flag, 730, breakfast quiet time. That's pretty strict. Mop Mo Yard, <laughs> Greg be a baby. Jeez, he, he, it sounds like he was real strict on him. My mom moved up to the loft after her brothers died. At the time, it was as far away as she could get. Ok, 
Okay, what we got here? another thing my mom never talked about, but I think it helped her a lot after her dad died. Hmm. Fly to India. She spent a summer building houses in Calcutta, where she met my dad, Sanjay. Oh, okay, so that, that, that explains a lot. Uh, cause I was wondering who Sanjay was. I guess that's everything up here. Nope. My mom moved to India a week after graduation and got a job teaching English. Lewis was born a year later. Okay, what we got up here? Graphics on this are real nice. I keep talking about the graphics on it, but... When my dad died, I don't think Mom knew where else to go. I'm sure Edie was happy to have her back. And to see kids in the house again. Milton. He's got all the pictures of the, uh... The castles, Lewis, Edith. The house had to get a little bigger, but Edie was used to that. And for a while, things were good, almost normal. Barbara, Molly, Sven, Odin, Calvin, Sam, Gregory, Gus, Barbara. <laughs> Lewis rules. So they did like homeschooling and stuff? Observation, question, research, hypothesis, experiment, data, conclusion. Seven ways to create f fulfilling classroom. Okay. <clears throat> the beginning of the end was Milton's tenth birthday, when Edie gave him a castle. Let's see if there's anything else out here. I think that's pretty much it. Yeah, it is. Okay, let's uh, go through the window. So this was Lewis's stuff. like to draw stuff. Alright guys, I think we're going to call it there for this episode. If you like, subscribe. We're going to start out with Milton next episode. So, uh, take care of yourselves.